The Honourable Member for Calgary for Sloan. Eight years of Liberal failures, they continue to break records, just not ones many can celebrate. Not only are one in five Canadians skipping meals, but food bank usage is at a record high. A Mississauga food bank saw a 41% increase in usage, serving more than 13,000 people in January alone. That's the average attendance of an Ottawa Senators game. Why does the Prime Minister continue to brag and celebrate his failed policies that sent 1.5 million Canadians into a food bank? Or was that his plan all along? Yeah. The Honourable Minister for Tourism. Mr. Speaker, we know that Canadians are going through a hard time. There's an inflationary cycle that has gripped the world. And the fact that in this country, Mr. Speaker, our inflation is lower than the average in the G7 and in the EU is not good enough for Canadians. And that's why we have a robust set of affordability measures in place, Mr. Speaker. The other side provides no hope, no plan, no vision for the future. We do. That's our job. We've got the back of Canadians. Honourable member for Calgary, Forest Lawn. They got the back pockets of Canadians, and we would never ever uh, vote for policies that made housing double. After eight years of their failures, rents and mortgages have doubled since 2015. Random Liberal Bill Morneau said that this government overspent. That made the Bank of Canada jack up its rates to counter that. And now CIBC is saying 20% of his mortgages are at a point where monthly payments don't even cover interest anymore. So will the most expensive housing minister in Canada's history stop patting himself on the back for a job well failed and admit that he broke housing in this country? Yeah. Yeah. The minister for sports. J'aimerais qu'on efface tout ce qui est arrivé au Canada puis dans le monde dans les dernières années, dont la pandémie. Mais ce qu'il faut se rappeler, c'est que ce gouvernement-ci a été là pour les gens qui en avaient le plus de besoins. Et il faut rappeler aussi qu'après les années du gouvernement conservateur, quand notre gouvernement est arrivé au pouvoir, on a sorti 2 millions de personnes de la pauvreté et on a créé plus d'emplois dans les 10 dernières années que pendant le règne des conservateurs. Ce gouvernement-ci en fait plus pour la population canadienne que les conservateurs en feront jamais. Merci, Monsieur le Président.